sir welcome you once again in the online lecture series of information system let's continue the part which are studied previously and then we move forward to the new topic so today our topic of discussion will be the various types of the information system up till we have seen what is actually mean by the information system then various components of the information system the concept related with the business etc etc okay now today the most important part on which the question uh, usually being asked for the 10 marks or the 8 marks and also two marks question is also possible just to name the various kind of information system okay so basically the term information system we have studied is nothing but what information system is the set of the interrelated components which is used for the collection storage processing and the distribution of the information okay that definition already we have discussed number of times as well as we have studied the different components using which our information system form what are the components software hardware software hardware data people data procedure okay. as a rules to utilize the information system etc etc this point already we have discussed now i also told you the examples of the information system also which are the examples of the information system business examples of the information system which are the different examples of the information system erp erp that we have office discussed automation. very good office automation office auto uh, expert, In, system, uh, expert system expert system etc correct so these are the examples that already we have discussed now here nowadays if you see the various kind of industries uh, small industries or the medium industries or the uh, what we can say the large industries everywhere there is a utilization of the information system and each in each particular organization might be having the their different need from the information system correct different organization use the information system based on their need now related with the organization number of times i have made clear the organization can be a manufacturing industry or it can be a educational institute also correct so what i want to ask whether the need of the educational institution and the need of the manufacturing industry related with the information system will be the same or different yes all of you got the question no sir whether the need of the information system need of the information system for the educational institute and the need of the information system for manufacturing industry whether it is same or the different 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 definitely it will be different manufacturing industry uh, uh, um utilize the information system for the different purpose and the educational institute utilize the information for the different purpose that already we have discussed okay so different information system can have their different kind of functionality yes or no and the uses correct yes yes it is correct or not different information system related with where actually they are being getting utilized whether they are getting utilized in the manufacturing industries or whether they are getting utilized in the educational institute 
their functionality will be different and their uses uses will be also be the different understood and because of that there is a certain categorization of the information system classification of the information system into the various types okay and mainly four types of the information system today we are going to discuss okay in that first one transaction processing system all of you must be able to see yes all of you, all of you can see the figure yes, sir. Yes. yes second type of information system is the management information system third type of information system as a decision support system and lastly fourth one ets which stands for the executive information system okay all of you got the four names first one is the transaction processing then management information decision support system and the last one is the executive information system which can be also called as the executive support system okay now we have to discuss these all the four kinds of information system one by one so first one is the transaction processing system okay now first point you uh, must be uh, clear here in the single organization now in order to understand this type of information system we will take the example of manufacturing industry all of you are agree yes yes sir in order to understand the types yes, of sir. the information system i take the example of manufacturing industries okay and in the manufacturing industry as all of you uh, know there are the different departments are there correct yes or no yes sir yes sir in the manufacturing industry there used to be the different departments there used to be the uh, different kind of employees who are working where the role of the employees are also different hierarchy of the employees also different correct related with that related with that last time we have discussed one point that is the management i hope all of you are uh, remembering that point which point management in the business correct which are the different levels of the management top level management middle level management and lower level management top middle and the lower level management correct what what do you mean by the management what is mean by the management managing Ah, yes. Yes. Managing the yes. Managing the yes. Correct. Continue. The process of managing the people or other things. Yes, it is a process of uh, what we can say the administrating or process of. managing the organization now what is the organization organization can be a profit making uh, company or the uh, institute profit making organization or it may be a non profit organization or it may be a government body understood so management in is such kind of organization is nothing but the uh, what we can say making the strategy or the plan doing the coordination and uh, cooperation of the employees setting the goals and the objective utilizing the various kind of resources available in the organization to fulfill the goals and the objectives so this is nothing but the all things related with the management we have seen okay now just now somebody told me ki, there are the as we have discussed three main levels of management top level management middle level management and the lower level lower. management so in the manufacturing industries there might be a single information system being utilized or there might be a more than one information system can be utilized yes or no yes sir if the organization is very much big okay if the organization is very much big then there are the chances that there can be a more than one information system can be 
utilize correct or not yes yes so now how where this kind of one more than one information system can be utilized there according to the level of the management what according to the level of the management more than one information system can be utilized you got the this point what according to the hierarchy or according to the level of the management more than one information system can be utilized in the certain organization yes or no yes yes and based on that only based on that only the types of the information system are there okay in that in that first one we have that is first one is what transaction processing system transaction processing system first information system now i hope all of you must be able to see this pyramid now in the is this this particular pyramid it is its size is getting decreases as it is going on upside correct yes all of you can able to see the this pyramid Yes. Yes, sir. yes, size is getting decreases as it is going upward. Now there is a specific meaning for that. What is that specific meaning? Specific meaning is what mostly utilized information system in the organization is which transaction processing system. Slice slightly less than transaction processing system. The uh, the information system being utilized is what MIS. That is the management information. system more less than management information system the information system which utilizes what decision support system and the most rarely information system utilized in the organization is what executive information system and that is the reason the diagram is being represented like this all of you got the point yes sir yes so which is the mostly utilized information daily the first one which is called as a transaction processing system system okay now here you don't have to just take the meaning of the transaction is like transferring the money from one account to the another account that is not the exact meaning of transaction here all of you agree with me yes here meaning of the transaction is what activities being done within an organization first all of you must understand this point all of you got the meaning of transaction yes sir here transaction meaning is what various kind of activities being done within a organization okay so in that related with the first information system if you ask me sir who is going to utilize this information system in the organization and this kind of information system being utilized in the organization by whom the workers or the employees and in another words the lowest level management the lowest level management utilize the first type of information system that is called as what the transaction processing system all of you understood yes sir yes. yes okay then for what purpose exactly it is being utilized okay for what purpose being it is utilized so the main purpose of the transaction processing system or the information system is nothing but record keeping of an organization that is nothing but the main utilization or purpose or the use of first information system that is what the transaction processing system what is the use record keeping of an organization can anybody explain me what what does it mean record keeping of an organization yes mayur so daily entries like entries of employees entries of employees ha uh -huh. आता आपल्या कॉलेज मध्ये कसं सर लोकांना एंट्री केल्यानंतर तिथे हे द्यावं लागतं थम लाईक लाईक दॅट 
तशी एंट्रीज ओनली दॅट मच इज द मिनिंग ऑफ रेकॉर्ड केपिंग एनीथिंग एल्स देन दॅट रेकॉर्ड किपिंग ऑफ एन ऑर्गनायझेशन वन पॉइंट यू टोल मी यस एनीबडी एल्स हा यस पेमेंट ऑफ वर्कर पेरोल सिस्टीम एंट्रीज द टेक्निकल वर्ड फॉर दॅट पेरोल सिस्टीम एंट्रीज व्हॉट सो डेली रेकॉर्ड किपिंग ऑफ एन ऑर्गनायझेशन इन्क्लूड ऑल दीज थिंग्स कॅन यू एबल टू सी दिस नेक्स्ट स्लाइड यस Yes. First kind of record like daily record keeping of sales and purchase. What sales and purchase means today is the thirteenth of July. How much sale is happened today of particular product, and whether the organization has purchased any raw material. Entry of that is being done where in the transaction processing system. Got the first first point. Got. yes first point understood or not yes sir daily record keeping yes, of sales and purchase second record can be a inventory is available now you tell me about this inventory is available last time i told you meaning of inventory inventory in the sense the material available what inventory in the sense material so it can be the raw material also okay so record keeping of inventories that is the another point next point the now the some students told me ki related with the payment record for that the technical term is what payroll system the entries of uh, payrolls and lastly most important billing system what billing system billing system in the sense what do you mean by the billing system je kai sell kele kiwa purchase kele tyache billing tyache billing je kai sell kele purchase kele tyache billing understood so all these yeah. kind of all these kind of record what all these kind of record and to maintain that record the kind of information system being used is nothing but what our first information system transaction processing system samajla saganna yes sir okay can we go to the next type of information system yes sir yes now when you go to the next information system now uh, what we do we will carry on with a one example suppose suppose uh, today itself the employee enter within a company or the organization and who who are with the manager there manager give the today's task to the employee for example we consider here the kind of employee as a salesman okay employee we are considering as what the salesman within a company correct okay all of you are getting my voice yes sir yes what yes. what example we are considering today the manager has assigned one task to the employee the employee are nothing but the salesman of the companies manager has assigned the task to the 10 salesman to sell the xyz product in certain areas understood the situation yes understand this example that i am giving you yes sir what what situation i told you what situation i told you 
मैनेजर ने एम्प्लॉय ला टास्क दी लाइक पर्टिकुलर मैनेजर हैज असाइन द टास्क टू द 10 एम्प्लॉइज एम्प्लॉय एम्प्लॉय चा टाइप काय किती सेल्स मने करेक्ट एंड मैनेजर है मैनेजर हैज आस्क देम टू सेल द सम एक्स वाई जेड प्रोडक्ट काहीतरी एक प्रोडक्ट आहे एक्स वाई जेड एंड टू सेल दैट प्रोडक्ट इन सर्टेन एरियाज करेक्ट नाउ when that employee will go into the certain area and they will sell the product and in the evening they will come to come back to the organization correct yes sir correct when they come back to the organization their entries will be made in the which information system transaction processing system correct or not correct yes sir yes, each individual employee sales pan record कि हाउ मच आइटम दे हैव सेल हाउ मच प्रोडक्ट दे हैव सेल देयर एंट्रीज विल बी डन इन द ट्रांजैक्शन प्रोसेसिंग सिस्टम देयर कम्स द यूटिलाइजेशन ऑफ द ट्रांजैक्शन प्रोसेसिंग सिस्टम नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड टू द नेक्स्ट नाउ वील वील कैरी ऑन विद द सेम एग्जांपल फर्स्ट वी अंडरस्टैंड द सेकंड इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम नाउ हियर सेकंड इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम इज व्हाट द मैनेजमेंट इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम and where actually it is being getting utilized at which level of management middle middle or junior middle manager or by the which is being also called as the junior managers also correct okay now junior the this middle managers required middle managers required what middle managers required he required the summary of the record what he requires summary of today's sale record okay what he needs summaries of the today's sale record how he can get it all of you understood my question no sir what i ask you middle management where which people are working middle managers what they need they need summary of the today's sale record summaries in the sense what okay ha uh, huh? sales kai kai jale kiti sales jale kai kai ha overall 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 record ha uh -huh. how which particular employee has sell how many items and uh, out of making the average of all these 10 salesman record that is nothing but the summary of the sales of particular today's record understood so providing the summary of today's sale record of these 10 salesman that is being done by whom that is being done by which information system management information system you got the point yes yes sir in the transaction processing system we are making the individual entries okay but yes. middle manager required what middle manager requires the consolidated record what consolidated in the sense the combined record ki how much total number of items has been sell by sell yes. by total number of employees today or the salesman today okay so that kind of that kind of information the middle manager can get the middle manager can get that kind of information using which kind of information system the management information system understood now yeah. that that is i have mentioned here for what purpose it is used it is used for the purpose of what summary report it is used for the purpose of what summary report if during the starting of the day manager has manager has given given the task to the employee that today at least you are selling total number of items must cross how much items 500 items how much 500 items now management information system can give that kind of information to the middle manager by doing the some calculation on total number of items sell by the each of the individual employee and that record is nothing but the summary is prepared that is called as what the summary prepared understood now management information system being utilized by the middle manager 
middle uh, management or the middle uh, manager how this information system will do the calculation of the summary how it will process that particular data and generate the summary so to generate this summary the manage this management information system need a data from which information system the first information system that is called as what the transaction processing system all of you understood yes, yes. yes management information system kon use karta middle manager correct so what middle manager refers middle manager refer the summary report okay combined report how this combined report can be generated only after some input will be given from the transaction information system then only this summary report can be get generated okay. understood and after the middle manager get the summary report he suppose overall today as during the starting of the day manager has asked at least 500 items must be get sale but only 400 items get sale correct only 400 items get sale 100 less than the target yes or no yes so based on that report the middle manager can make the decision what he can do he can make the decision ki from tomorrow you must you must put more effort or he he may take the decision he may take the decision to add more number of salesmen in that areas like that kind of decision can be taken by whom the middle manager which is being working or which is being referring which is being referring what the management information system which is being referring what Man management information system understood all of you second type of information system who is yes, who, it, it is utilized by whom middle manager correct or the junior manager for what purpose is it is utilized summary report correct summary report summary report. report and from that what he can do he can generate some action report ki ki if the if the employee has if the employee has sell less than the target then he can he can create one action report or he can take some kind of decision in that he he might he might increase the number of salesman in that area or he might replace another salesman in place of the today's salesman if some salesman has not done their duties as compared with the another salesman yes or no so accordingly this information system being utilized by the middle manager for this kind of different purpose and to make the various kind of decision okay let's move forward to the next third information system that is nothing but what decision support system or which can be also called as decision information system it is utilized by whom it is utilized by the senior managers senior manager right okay now. or the hrs now here you have to you have to take in mind you have to keep in mind this is being also utilized by the middle management also according to the level management decision support system is also utilized by which which level of the management middle, middle management, management. Middle. Middle. but in the middle management there can be a junior junior managers as well as there can be a senior managers senior manager yes so decision support system is utilized by the senior managers or the hr etc etc okay now for what purpose it is being utilized that is my question now purpose for which it is being utilized is nothing but handling the complex data and representing representation of the complex data by some simplified way that simplified way can be either your graphs and it can be your charts now this this particular third information system that is the decision support system it is also doing the same thing that is being done by 
our second information system that is the management information system only difference here is what see here only difference here is what this summary report this kind of summary report is being converted into this summary report is being converted into some kind of graphical representation for the purpose of better understanding that is reason i have written here representation of complex data by graphs and the charts all of you are getting yes yes sir what is the utilization of the decision support system and how it is different from the management information system how it is different from the management information system yes first difference is what it is being utilized by which people senior managers or senior the manager. or the hr okay. okay now this information system it is being utilized to do the deep analysis and to transform the information they are getting from the management information system that is from the second information system and representation of that information system in the more simplified way okay now if i ask you if i ask you data which is being data which is being entered in the excel file where data which is being entered in the excel file and representation of data that data by using some graphs and the chart which one is the more easily understandable that is my question graphical all of you got the question More easily understood data which is being entered in the excel format and data which is being represented in the using the graphs and the chart which one is the more understandable graphs definitely graphs and charts now another related to that another question i want to ask to make the decision using the excel form data versus to make the decision using the graphs and chart which decision will be made more quickly graphs and chart graphs and chart. the charts chart. that is the point i want to make make you clear here ki decision difference between the decision support system and management support system, management information system is not too much only the data which is being received from the management information system being represented in more simplified form that is nothing more simplified form is nothing but the representation using the graphs and chart so that so that it will be this kind of more complex data more complex kind of data can be uh, represented in the more simplified form and from that the quick decision kind of quick decision making can be done from the middle management that is nothing but the main utilization of our third information system that is the decision support system support system all of you understood the third one yes sir all of you understood the difference between the second information system and the third information system yes sir yes yes so according to the our example that we are discussing related with the salesman if the junior managers give record to the senior managers or to the uh, higher managers which is higher than the Uh, junior manager so we consider here just the junior manager and the senior manager so junior manager will be utilizing which information system mis senior manager utilizing utilizing which information system decision support system so junior manager provide the data in the form of for example we consider in the excel form to transform that data into graphs and chart that is being done by which information system decision support system so that the senior managers or the hrs they can take the or they can make the process of decision making quickly as compare with the previous kind of information system 
so representation of more complex data in simplified form so that the process of decision making can be improved that is only nothing but the utilization of third information system that is what decision support system all of you got the point yes all of you got the difference between the second information system and the third yes sir lakshata like a difference is what only related with the representation of data and if the data representation happens more uh, simplified way then the process of making decision will be get improved yes. correct so that is nothing but the difference here let's move forward to the last kind of information system which is being utilized by whom the top management whom top management of the organization and name of that information system is what executive information system what do you mean by the executive means what what do you mean by the executive yes in progress executive meaning of the executive yes mayur what do you mean by the executive the the apan middle middle manager ka the summary report senior manager la deto तसच सिनियर मॅनेजर आपलं जे ग्राफिकल रिप्रेझेंटेशन आहे बरोबर ते टॉप मॅनेजमेंट कडे देत म्हणजे ते एक फायनल डिसिजन घेऊ शकतो नाही नाही व्हॉट आय एम आस्किंग की एक्झिक्युटिव्ह मीन्स हु विच काइंड ऑफ पीपल्स एक्झिक्युटिव्ह मीन्स चेअरमॅन बरोबर नाही तर लिहिलं ऑलरेडी आय मेन्शन हिअर चेअरमन व्हाईस चेअरमन ओके चेअरमन व्हाईस चेअरमन डायरेक्टर डायरेक्टर सीओ एटसेट्रा दिस दॅट इज बिंग ऑल बिंग कम अंडर द top management of the certain yeah. industry understood now top management utilize the information given by the third information system this is the this is the what you can say level wise means information information provided by the first information system that is the tps utilized by whom management information system on that information system certain processing happens then this information system provided from the mis to the next information system that is the decision support system here also here information which the decision support system get from the mis on that some processing happens and the representation of that in the form of the graphs and chart happens and then it is being given to the top management like the chairman vice chairman or the president director ceo etc so the executive information system utilize the information information that is they are receiving from now what we are discussing here this is complete chain chain of, chain of what the tps provide the information to the mis and mis provide the information to the dss and again the dss provide information to the executive information system all of you go, all of you got this scenario yes yes now currently we are discussing the executive information system who who is using this information system the top management etc etc okay now this kind of information system is also called as another name for that is the ess executive support system and it is being utilized for the top yeah, management or the senior yeah. most you can also call give the name yeah, it as senior yeah. most management also okay now what exactly it does what is the what is the exact role or purpose for which the executive information system being utilized by top management of the certain industry okay now here i have written for what purpose it is being utilized so the top management 
with the help of the executive information system it it the kind of support they get from the executive information system that is nothing but by using the various format reports they are receiving from the all management levels okay whatever the reports they are getting from the first information system second information system and third information system everything being reaches to whom everything being reaches to the last kind of information system that is what executive information system and then their executive information system try to generate some trend report what it generate some kind of trend report means what trend report what do you mean by the word trend take the same example that we are discussing because that is regarding the selling of the product now record related with the selling of the product generated in the tps then it goes to the mis then from the mis it goes to the decision support system then from the decision support system it reaches to the whom executive information system who is going to utilize the executive information system top management of the company now executive information system generate the different kinds of trend report means what trend report trend means what can anybody tell me what is the meaning of trend करंट ट्रेंड गोइंग ऑन Yes. So certain trend can also be related with the single product, yes or no? Certain kind of trend can be related with the single product, yes or no? Yes. Yes. So if certain product demand is huge in the market, you understand the situation. What certain product demand is what? huge in the market then company can decide to launch the new product yes or no yes. if certain product demand is huge company can decide can, can able to decide the new product launching yes or no all of you are getting what i am asking if certain product uh, trend related with certain product is very positive in the market for example smartphone take example what smartphone everybody is utilizing what smartphone so certain company can decide so certain company can decide to launch the new kind of smartphone in the company correct yes yes if company selling some product and selling of that product or demand of that product is continuously decreasing okay if company is selling some product and demand of that product is co continuously what is happening decreasing correct can company take the decision of delisting that existing product what delisting means what do you understand the meaning of delisting not uh, not making that product stop making the production of certain product stop that is nothing but the meaning of delisting Delist. correct how when company can take such kind of decision it is in not demand or trend how the company will know that is not in the demand by the public reaction 
by how the or not selling that ha how how this kind of things will reach to the executives or to the top management will the information system can be a most useful there yes exactly yes, because sir. how the top management will know top management will know according to the record they will get from who transaction processing system then from the management information system and then from the decision support system and at last this information will reach to the executive information system and executive information trend will be according to that xyz product trend will be positive or the negative related with the product whose demand is decreasing the trend will be positive or the negative negative exactly the trend will be negative, negative. and that kind of generation of trend report will be done by which information system that kind of trend report generation will be done by which information system executive that is the your last information system executive information system and so to to stop the production of certain product this kind of decision cannot be taken by the this information system or the people who are working in the middle management or the people who are working in the lower management these people cannot take this decision whether some whether to launch new product or whether to delist the existing product such kind of decision only taken place by whom executive of the certain company that is nothing but top management of the company that is with the help of what which kind of information system executive information system correct yes sir other information system role is what to just provide that kind of information to the top management that is nothing but the role of all these information system kai ki hi ji information hi kuna parent pohchli pahije top management par top management might be in the different forms each each of these information system is maintaining their record in the different forms correct yes so at last all these information must reach to the executive information system and then and then only the decision can be taken understood even if middle management or the lower management take some decision approval for that decision will be taken by or approval for that decision only made by which information system only executive information system and that is nothing but what we can say the uh, role performed by our last information system that is the executive information system all of you got the point Yes, sir. All of you got the last information system. Yes. Yes. All of you got the last information system. Yes, sir. And here also I have mentioned the same point that we have discussed. It helps to analyze the trends by viewing the various kind of reports, including the summaries. including the charts graphs and then making the strategic decision for the business making the strategic decision in the sense can make the long term plan for certain companies long term uh, strategies or the long term plan for certain decision, uh, uh, related with certain company and if if the company will not follow the trend reports or company not follow the market demands then what can happen that example for that you can take the example for that best example you can take that is the example of nokia mobile company all of you must be knowing about the nokia company yes yes sir is there anybody who is using the nokia company mobile now ha huh? hatta nahi vapra you will not find uh, one person people also correct yes sir 
correct yes or no yes but but yes, if you if you see the uh, uh, period before the 10 years if you see the period before the 10 years 80% of market were captured by the nokia company yes, what sir. how much yes, 80% of market were captured by the nokia company then how how they have come in this kind of situation today why there is a such kind of poor situation of nokia company today can anybody tell me sir smart phones aale printers wale aale tyamule halu halu ata nokia je fakt button wale sai je pehle ha ha man te printers aale manun halu halu te button je sigle mane nokia screen touch etc etc means nokia Nokia fail to go along with the with to trend. go along with the trend of the market, correct or not? Yes, yes. Yes. They didn't focus on what exactly the customer is demanding. Customer was demanding. Customer was not demanding the expensive mobile. Customer was demanding the cheap mobile with cheap. more functionality. Am I right or not? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But the Nokia didn't. didn't adapt or didn't change according to the demand of the customers they just focus on the hardware of the mobile there is a one big advantage related with the nokia company mobile you can ask to the uh, dealers also that hardware being utilized in the nokia company mobiles are most It, that that hardware is having the longest life as compared with the any other mobile hardware for your kind information means what that mobile life is more as compared with the other smartphone mobile correct yes if the mobile hardware is what we can say of very good quality then definitely the life of the mobile will be longer as compared with the other Long. company mobile but today situation is what apan smartphone jasti jasti kiti varsha use karto ek 2 year hardly hardly 2 year correct hardly 2 years and that is the reason the other companies like the samsung redmi or there are the apple Apple Cloud. number of companies are providing the better uh, uh, functionality as compared with the Nokia. Understood. So such kind of feedback from the market or such kind of response from the market nowadays can easily reach to the top management of the company within a very less amount of time. And reason for that is nothing but evolution of the various kind of information system. that is from transaction information system to the management information system to the decision support system up to up till executive information system correct or not yes all of you got the point Yes, sir. Yes. So this is nothing but the our today's session. Various types of the information systems. Who is utilizing that information system at the various level of management, and for what purpose these information system are being getting utilized? Correct. So lastly, just uh, we just recap. Who is who is utilizing the transaction processing system? workers for what purpose uh, daily record keeping yes daily record next who is using the management information system middle management middle management uh, like you can call there the junior Manager. managers junior managers okay for what purpose they are using that Summary the generating the generating the summary of information they are getting from the previous information system next who is using the decision support system 
सीनियर मैनेजर सीनियर मैनेजर और फॉर व्हाट पर्पस सीनियर मैनेजर फॉर व्हाट पर्पस रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ कॉम्प्लेक्स डेटा बाय ग्राफ्सिंग यस एग्जैक्टली एग्जैक्टली एंड लास्टली हु इज यूजिंग द एग्जीक्यूटिव इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम Top management, top management. For what purpose? Trend report. To generate the trend report and from that trend report to take the decision like new product launching, deleting the delisting the existing product, approval for the decision okay. taken by the lower management, etc. etc. Now my pointed question here, last question I want to ask you, pointed question. <laughs> If the transaction processing system will not work properly, all of you are listening. if yes, the sir. transaction processing system will not work properly then will the management information system will get the correct input or not no no, no. these all no. system no. are interlinked with each other for your kind information yes. the yes. output generated by the transaction processing uh, system given as a input to the management information system management. then output generated by the management information system given as a input to the decision support system and output generated by the dss is given to the executive information system so in order to get the complete benefit of the information system to the particular company all these kind of information system need to be work properly correct or not Yes, yes, sir. Yes, so that is nothing but our today's point of discussion. समझ ले सकें ना? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Here today I have the one quote for you. That is the today's quote. Do something today that your future itself will thank you for that. Means what? Don't waste the today's time that you are getting. Utilize that time to learn something new things. so that that new thing will help you in the future correct future. yes sir so that's it yes, sir. for the today's session shall i conclude now yes, yes sir wait for wait for one minute let me take your attendance okay sir okay if anybody have not got any point i am uploading this video on the youtube in the youtube also you can comment me for any doubt okay i will definitely answer them okay okay sir okay, okay. thank you all of you